Hello, hello. Good night, guys. Hello. Finally, she's here, you said. Hi, teacher. Right? I, I think Mr. Moran was giving me the, the quarter rule, right? If she does not appear in 15 minutes, we're going to go. Uh-huh. Yes, because I remember the once he put that on the WhatsApp group. <laughs> Hello, guys. How are you? Good, Good night. Good, Good night. Good. It's been a pleasure to have you here. As you know, guys, I had just finished my privately class, so may I apologize if I'm a little bit late today. Okay? You know what? I was really worried that I thought I won't be able to, to give today's classes. Why? Because um, um, there was like a la light turn off here. I don't know if it's only in my house or my neighbor, my neighborhood. I don't know. But I didn't have internet connection and no light and everything. So I was like, oh my God. <laughs> For I, the I, rain? Maybe, but it was not an electrical rain. So that was, I was like, oh, well. Why, right? Because that had never happened. It's really weird that had happens here, at least in my neighborhood. But it happened. So I was like, oh my God. And I had a class from eight to nine, and then I have you guys. So I was like, oh my God. But thanks God at 7.40 came back. And I was like, ooh. But I didn't have access, internet access. And I was like, oh, no way. I'm so lucky. <laughs> but finally, I got internet access. And I was able to give my first glance and I was able to be with you. So I'm happy. Uh, guys, and I'm sorry for the delay. I need to apologize for that. And I'm sorry that I have not sent it to you the PowerPoint file right now. But I had to let you know what happened. And Mr. Moran will understand me a lot because he's a, he worked in the IT department. Guys, um, well, I used to have two phones. And the first one, the... Um, the power thing, I don't know what happened, but like, it broke. And then the second one, it was working fine, but finally, I don't know what happened, died. My phone died. So, oh my God, I don't have WhatsApp. How am I supposed to get in touch with these guys? Well, uh, I, my uncle lent me this little one, this old Alcatel One Touch. That is a no phone, right? And I was like, oh my God, please, this phone and needs to be able to support WhatsApp at least. And this little one supports WhatsApp. I'm impressed. So, wow, that's nice. Because imagine, I can have a WhatsApp on my cell phone, on my network, right? But they, they ask you for the QR code in order to display the information that you have in, here in this phone, in the screen, right? In your computer. So if I don't, if I cannot open from here, how am I supposed to have it displayed on my computer? I'm like, oh my God. But finally, this little one is working fine. So I'm so happy that at least I can communicate with you guys. And some, uh, something else happens to me. This weekend was really, wow, I think out of the context. Um, my, the router, I don't know what happened, but it didn't work. So I had to call the internet service department and come back to change it. Okay, they changed it and it was working really fine, the internet with the tablets, with the cell phones, with the computer with Windows 10, but I was using computer with Windows 7 and it didn't work. And I was like, oh my God, and I need it. So I have to call back, another technician came, changed the router, can you imagine? And it was working fine Windows 7 when he was here. When he left, the computer died again. And I was like, oh my God. So I'm not going to talk to them again. So what I have done, I have to migrate the computer that I use with you guys to change it from Windows 7 to Windows 10. Because if not, it's not going to work. So because of that, the information and everything, I, ha I have it in the, in the other hardware, right? So I have to like, take it off from the USB and then translate it into this new computer in order for me to pop it up and send it to you. So do you understand what I said? Sorry if I'm yes, speaking yes. too fast. Yes. Moran, yes. I know that you understood because you are an IT department, so you understood perfectly, right? 
Right. Yes. Uh, so, may I apologize for that. Okay. So, thank you so much for your patience. And this week, I will send it to you. Okay. I promise. That's why I didn't send it to you the file because I had problems with my computer and with my cell phone. But now I'm happy because I have a computer and at least I have this Alcatel One Touch that is working really fine. Okay. It's old, okay, no but it works. Okay. Yeah, that's why I need to apologize with you guys. But that's the reason why I couldn't send it to you. But at least I sent it to you to practice the Tango Twisters, right? Yes. Did you practice yeah. then? Mm -hmm. no. And a little bit. Algardo, I sent it to you because you asked me to. So, yeah. you practice, my dear friend. Ah, no way. That can practice. You, you couldn't practice. So, so. So, so. Okay, just give it a try. Okay, I want to hear you. I want to hear you the big, big, the big you. You can do it. Me? Yes, you. Yeah. Uh, Do your best. Okay, I okay, can't remember. He's there. Who remembers the last uh, uh, tangle to sir? I don't remember. You don't remember. That's not possible. Mm -hmm. No, I don't remember. No, you teacher. don't remember. Sorry. Who remembers that? The star, the tongue twister. The tongue twister. Uh, I think do you remember. Uh, Gabby, do you remember that? Mm, not much, but I searched in the internet. Aha. Uh -huh. It shows a big black bug. He had a big, a big black, black dog on his big black. black nose. Do you remember that? Yes. Okay, we're going. Okay, so we're going to guys. I'm going to uh, write it to you right now in the chat, and I'm going to ask some of you to say part of the tongue twister. Okay, so for example, Moran will say the first part. Then Luis is going to say the second part. Then Maurice is going to end, and finally Fernando. Okay. okay. I'm going to write okay. it to you. Okay. Let me check. Uh, yes. There you go. You have it then. Do you have it, guys? Yes. Yes. Okay, cool. So uh, let me start. A big black bug. Continue, Moran. Big, a big black dog. Okay, finish, Mauricio. Can you finish it, Mauricio? Oh, his big black nose. Very good. Okay, can we say that in the opposite way? Okay, a big black nose. Can you continue, Mauricio? Black, big black, black dog. No. Big black dog. No, a big, big a black big. nose. You have to say on his big black dog. On his big black nose, sorry. And then we'll run big, a big black dog. Okay? Very good. Okay, let's practice. Gabby, you start, please. Gabby Galdames. Ah, sorry. Gabi Galdames. Okay. A big black bug. Okay, then you continue, Gabi M. With the big black dog. Okay, and then you finish, Sandra. Sandrita, do you you need to finish? I think something happens with her internet, right? Sandra is fresh. Sandra's frozen. Okay, continue, uh, Luis. <laughs> On his big black nose. Very good. One more time. Can you start, Fernando? Don't sleep. A big black dog. Very good. Continue, Edgardo. A big black dog. A big black dog. Okay, he is starting. Now you continue, Edgardo. Uh, uh, the second time. No, no, uh -huh. I, I don't see. You don't see a big I black dog? This one. Second. This one, the one that I highlighted on the shot. I can you see it? See shot. Ah, you cannot see the shot. Come on. Technology, technology, no. teacher. Te technology, don't worry. <laughs> the technology abrounds me as well. 
No? <laughs> Don't worry, that's okay. Let's continue, <laughs> Mater. Black notes. Very good, a big black note. Okay, uh, let me start. Alex, can you start, please? A big black book. Okay, continue, Moran. With a big black dog. Okay, and finish it, uh, Mauricio. Oh, his big black nose. Very good. One more time. Can you start, Luis? A big black book. Okay, then continue, Fernando. <coughs> big, a big black dog. Okay, and finish it, Sandra. On a big black nose. Yes, but we cannot listen to you, Sandra. I don't know what's, what happened. We cannot listen to you. At least not me. <coughs> Can you listen to her, guys? No. no. No, no, we cannot listen to you. Something happens with your microphone, but don't worry about it. Just fix it, okay? Very good. Okay, let me raise it, guys. And then we're going to say it by memory, okay? Uh huh. You have memory, guys? Yes. All righty. Yes. Okay. Very good. So, are you ready? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Go yes. ahead. Say it, please. Uh, Fernando. A big black dog. Big a big black dog on his big black nose. That's amazing. Go ahead, um, um, Moran. Big black dog. Big a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good, Mauricio. A big black dog with a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good. Okay, I have Mr. America Diaz, who looks like a DJ today. So could you please be so kind, America, to say this, um, this tango twister in a DJ way? Uh, hello? Yes, yes, we can listen to you. Yes, go ahead. Uh, uh, the, first, the first part or...? or Everything. A big black dog with a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good. Excellent. Not too bad. Excellent. There you go. Okay. Uh, who else? Gaby Gaby Galdames. Gaby Galdames, could you please be so kind to say this? Uh Tongo Sister, but in a child way. Okay. <laughs> uh, a big black dog with a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good. Uh, Sandrita, can you hear us? Sí. Yes. yes. Sandrita, sí. do me a favor. Can you say this tongue twister, but if you're punishing your children, si lo, como que los estuviera regañando. Okay. A big black dog, big a big, big a big black dog on his big black nose. Oh my God, you're scaring me. <laughs> <laughs> like, a, oh, I don't want to be her child. Okay, that's good, excellent. Like a mother. <laughs> you see, she is a mom, definitely. There's no doubt about it. I am, I am mom. <laughs> yes, you were a mom, definitely. Okay, um, Mauricio, I just want you to say the tango twister, but if you are asking for sorry, if you make a mistake, we with your wife or with your girlfriend. Like if you're sorry. You need to apologize, okay? Hmm. A big black dog on a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good, and I like your face. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ah, yeah, yeah, you sound like a really sorry guy. That's nice, very good. And last but no least, and who else? Maynard. Okay. Okay, Maynard. I just want you to say this exactly thing, but if you are uh, like in a hurry, uh, like if you were running, uh, I don't understand. Okay. Uh, are you in a hurry? Estás como apurado? Are you in a hurry? Okay. Okay. So I want you to say the tongue twister if you are in a hurry. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay. A big black dog with a big black dog on his big black nose. Very good. Casi no. le falta aliento, like. <sighs> All <Yeah>. right. <laughs> Very good. Um, Fernando. Okay. Can you say like tongue twister, but if you are a cat. Como okay. Un gatito. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, look, Gary, like, <laughs> yes, you can say it. You can try. Okay, it. teacher. All right. Okay, okay. Meow. A me black dog. Big a big black dog. Oh, he big black nose. That is fantastic. <laughs> you know what? You sound like a Felix the cat. Yeah, right, right, Sandri? Do you remember him? Yeah. Very good. Very happy teacher. Yeah, very good. And last but not least, Edgardo, you want to try? Yeah. Okay. Now, oh. mm, are, you are a grandpa, aren't you? Oh, <laughs> grandpa. Yes? Grandpa, abuelito. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 you do me a favor. Do me a favor. No, no. Okay. Say the, the tango twister right now. Like the mood that you have. Feliz. Como estas ahorita. Say it. Uh, You're laughing. <laughs> like that. <laughs> exactly. Like that. Como oh. que, ahorita. Como que estás. <laughs> like that. <laughs> como estabas ahorita. Oh, exactly. a big black dog with a big black dog on his big black nose. You see, that sounds great. Fantastic. Excellent. Thank you. you see? Hey, yeah. And last but not least, Luis. Oh, yeah, Let me double check, Luis. Mm. No, this is not. Normal, normally. No, normally, no. 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 <laughs> ah, yes. You have to say the tongue twister, but without opening your mouth. What am I going to say? Like a big blood dog, big a big blood dog, like that, like that. Please. Okay. You can say it. I try. Like that. Okay. Don't open your uh, mouth. If you open your mouth, you're loose. A big black dog with a big black dog with a big black nose. Very good. And you know why I make you do that? It's not because we like to have so much fun. No way. Yes, we do, but it's not a purpose. <laughs> yeah. The purpose is that it, it is it's, it's a physical exercise that you do. And it's part of the pronunciation exercise. So that will help you to manipulate and to get flexible the muscles of your face. It's like if you were doing like this. Like that? It's exactly like that. Why? because you are forced to open your lips and the sound come up okay so uh, that will help you with the pronunciation of words that's what i make you do that you see you see you you close your your mouth like this like this you put your the two groups of your teeth together but you open your lips and even though you didn't open your mouth, we could hear you and we understood what you said. Right, guys? Right. Right? You see? So that is one of a pronunciation exercise. Okay, guys? So now on, I just want you guys to practice the pronunciation. I'm going to send you some, some texts, some little texts. And I want you guys to put your the pencil, pen, or whatever you have here. I like dish. And when you do that, you need to force to open your mouth, no matter what. So that will help you with the pronunciation. For example, take a look at this. I'm going to put it here, and I will pronounce the tongue to the A big black bug with a big black dog on his big black nose. You see? Yeah. You got to open your mouth. So that is another pronunciation exercise. You like it? I like it. You see? Yeah. You're learning something new. And I promise you to help you with everything, with all the skills, and uh, that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, guys, so are you ready to start the party with me? Yay, yay. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, we already did. <laughs> you know, we already did. We already started talking, okay? And practicing intonation and pronunciation with the tongue of sister. And also memory, guys. Memory. <laughs> memory is really important. You know what? For example, this is one of other skills that you have to develop and you have to work on it. For example, in the future, guys, you would like to work uh, as an interpreter, for example, of Spanish and English. For example, this is a skill that you need to have. Memory yes. and concentration. This is one of the skills that are really important besides listening, right, and speaking. 
So that's why that's why we're doing that, girl, guys. It's not because I just want to have so much fun with you. It's because I want you to learn, but in a fun way. So are you guys ready? Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Edgardo, I like you. I like the way you are so happy today. Okay. Guys, I just want you to listen carefully to um, a dialogue, okay? I just want you to listen to a dialogue. This dialogue is to talking about going out, going out uh, to eat. Oh, that would be really nice, right? But guys, I just want you to pay attention. Today, we're going to learn some agreement phrases that I think you already have heard or maybe you already have used use it. Have you heard, for example, so, to, either, either and neither? Exactly. We're going yes. to learn, guys, um, how to use them, okay? This okay. is called agreement okay. words. I just want you to pay attention on the dialogue so you will be able to see how they're using the dialogue. We're going to learn grammatically how to use them. And also, guys, we're going to work in that pronunciation of them. Okay? That's okay. what we're going to do. Today. Okay. This is going to be today's okay. class. So hopefully you enjoy <laughs> that. Okay, cool. So, guys, allow me just one minute. Let me share right now my screen with you because I just want you to pay attention to the dialogue. And then we're going to discuss that. We're going to play the dialogue, guys, two times. Okay? Only two times this week. Okay. So I just want you 100% concentrated. But I just want to know if you are able to see my screen. Are you able to see my screen? Yes. 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 Cool. Yes. So listen carefully. There you go. Getting something to eat. Part A. Listen and practice. Say, do you want to get something to eat? Sure. I'm tired of studying. So am I. So... What do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Yeah, I like it a lot. So do I, and I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Okay, one more time. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'm not even. Okay. Let me put it here. Mercedes? Say, do you want to get something to eat? Sure. I'm tired of studying. So am I. So, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah. I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Yeah. I like it a lot. So do I. And I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. All right. Guys, before we continue, any questions regarding vocabulary that you might have? Mood? No. Mood. 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 Animo. De humor. Animo. Exactly. Oh. What else? Yes. What else, guys? Hey which one? Either. 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 Ah, that's what we're going to see today. Don't worry about that. That's what we're going to see today. Either. Okay. What else, guys, besides that? Guess. I guess. I guess. Yo creo. Um, o yo pienso. O yo supongo. O yo supongo. Exactly. What else, guys? Any other uh, vocabulary that you might have? Spicy, picante. picante. Exactly, a little bit okay. spicy. Sí, la comida india es picante. Usa mucho eh, condimentos. Y el, condimentos. el bit es, es a little bit, un poco, a little bit. It's a bit uh, spicy, un poquito bit, picante. A bit spicy. Yes, a bit spicy. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, let's practice a pronunciation before we go to the grammar then. So repeat after me. Say. 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 Do you Bye. want to get something to it? Do you want, Do you to, want get to get something to eat? Get something to eat? Sure, I'm tired of studying. 
Sure. I'm tired of studying. I'm tired of studying. So am I. 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 Again, guys. So am I. So am I. 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 You see? So am I. Okay? So, so am I. I. Very good. So what do you think of Indian food? So what do you think of Indian food? Indian food? What do you think of Indian food? Very good. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But I'm not really in the mood for it today. But I'm not really in the mood for it today. Mood for today. Mood today. today. Ah, you're missing the eat. ¿Quién se comió el eat? Come on, again. But I'm not really in the mood for it today. But, but I'm not but really I'm in not the mood really for, for it today. today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. I know yeah, either. I am not either, I guess. I guess. It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Do you like yeah, Japanese, Japanese food? food? Yeah, I like it a lot. Yeah, yeah I, I like, like it a lot. lot. Uh -uh. Yeah, okay, what? Well, all together, guys. I like it a lot. I, I like it a lot. lot. I, it a lot. Okay. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Again, I like again, Moran. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. A lot. Uh, very I like good. It a lot. Very good. So do I. So do I. So do I. So do I. And I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. I know a great restaurant. It's called Aroha. It's called Aroha. Aroha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Yeah, I always wanted to go there. Okay, let's practice this one. I've, 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 I've always, I've always, I always wanted, I've always wanted, I always wanted to go, I always wanted to go, I always wanted to go there, I always wanted to go there. If you if you said it fast, guys, you see that you do not pronounce one words it's because you say it fasted. I always wanted to go there. You see? You say you, you don't I pronounce wanted, right? Want I wanted to go there. Wanna. You can say I wanna or wanted. Wanna. It's okay. I always wanted to go there. Okay, guys, let's practice again, okay? Say, do you want to get something to it? Say, say do, do you want, want to get to something, to get something, something to, to it? Something to it? Yeah. Sure, I'm tired of starting. Sure. So am I. So am I. So what do you think about uh, of Indian food? So, so what, what do you think of Indian food? Food? Food. 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 food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. For it today. For it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Yeah. Do you like Japanese spice. food? Yeah, I like it a lot. Yeah, yeah I, like I like it a lot. It a lot. <laughs> so do I. So, so do I. I. And I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Aroha. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Oh, I always wanted to go there. I wanted. I just wanted to go there. To go. To go to there. No. To go there. I always wanted to go there. Very good. Very good. Always wanted to go there. Guys. To go there. Exactly. Do you remember, guys, when you were studying or when you were at work, for example? Están cansados de hacer lo mismo de estudiando y quieren ir con sus compañeros o con sus colegas a comer algo a un lugar, right? It's exactly like that. Yeah. Ya les ha pasado eso, eh? Mira, hoy tengo ganas de comer comida china. Hoy tengo ganas de comerme una pizza de la pizza hot, aunque me caiga mal el aceite. I don't care. Okay. Yeah. Ajá. Uh -huh. O oh, mira, hoy tengo ganas de ir al changarrito que está aquí en la esquina. Right? Yeah. Exactly. Or oh, I want Mexican food. Right? Sí. Entonces, es exactamente lo mismo. Son dos estudiantes, compañeros, queriendo comer algo porque ya, tienen, ya no quieren estudiar. La edad. ¿Sí? Traten de meterse en ese char character and then practice. Vamos a ver two um, victims, sorry, two participants. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> sé que son dos guys. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, vamos a ver. I want uh, Maynard is going to be Jeff. And Alex, you're going to be Bob. One, two, okay. three. Action. Go ahead. Okay. Say, do you want to get uh, something to eat? Sure. I'm tired of studying. Mm -hmm. So am I. So what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Uh, yeah, I like it a lot. So do I. And I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Airoha. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Yeah, again. <laughs> Okay. The, the last part, eh, the, the last part, Maynard. Okay. Oh, I've always wanted, uh, wanted to go there. Very good. One more time, please. Okay. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Fantastic. You see? Very good. Now we're going to inverse the characters or the personages. Now, um, Alex, you're going to start as Jeff. And Maynard, you're going to be Bob. Action number two. Say, do you want to get something to eat? Sure, I'm tired of starting. So am I. So, what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either, I guess. It's a bit spicy. Do you, do you like Japanese food? Yeah, I like it a lot. So, do I. Um, and I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Iroha. Oh, I only went to together. To, together or to, to go, go there? there? Ah, okay. To go and, there. Ah, you see? The teachers have a really good listening. Go ahead, Alex. One more time, please. I only went to go there. Okay, that's what I need. Very good. Ah, come on. Ah, the teacher is a, is a really good listener. Peor que un yeah. físico. You're yes. me. You're me. <laughs> no, I'm not me. I'm good teacher. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Next victims, next participants. I want two girls. Okay. Let's work with Gabby a la, a la segunda potencia. That means two Gabbies. Gabby M, you're going to start, and then Gabby A. Galdames, you're going to be Bob. Okay. Go ahead, Gabby. Action. Okay. Do you want to get something to eat? Sure, I'm tired of studying. So am I. So what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Yeah, I like it a lot. <laughs> so, so do I. And I know... Uh, Sorry. <laughs> and I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Airoja. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Okay. Again, Gabby, the last one, please. Oh, I've always wanted to go there. Very good. And only one more thing that I want you to repeat, this one. How do you pronounce this? It's... Okay, so do me a favor. Pronounce all these sentences, please. It's a bit spicy. No, again. Pronounce it again. It's a bit spicy. Again. It's a bit spicy. You're missing the S. It's a bit spicy. It's a bit spicy. Very good. That's what I want. I I, I couldn't hear the, the, the bird to be. That's why I asked you to repeat it again. But that's good. Excellent job. Now we're going to inverse the characters. And now, Gabby Galdames, you're going to start. And Gabby M, you're going to be Bob. Go ahead. Action number two, please. Hey, do you want to get uh, something to eat? Sure, I'm tired of studying. So am I. So what do you think of Indian food? I love it, but I'm not really in the mood for it today. Yeah, I'm not either. I guess it's a bit spicy. Do you like Japanese food? Yeah, I like it a lot. So do I, and I know a great restaurant near here. It's called Airoja. Oh, I always wanted to go there. Very good. Excellent, guys. Yeah, congratulations. Excellent job. You see, practice makes perfection. Okay. Okay. Did you notice, guys, that 
when they are talking about food and if they are agree or they are not agree with the restaurant, with the type of food, etc., they use so do I, so am I, me neither, right? Mm -hmm. That's what we call um, words of agreement. Have you used them, guys? Diana and Osado, have you used them? Yes. Two, yes. Okay. How do you use them? ¿Cómo la usaste? ¿Por qué la usaste, Gaby? Um, for example, when uh, someone say that I like uh, something, mm -hmm. I couldn't say I like too. Mm -hmm. And I love you too. Mm -hmm. Ah, me too, Gaby. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Y eso usaste, so am I, so do I, o either or neither. ¿Cuál usaste? Um, so am I. Okay. Very good. Excellent, guys. So, quiero que... Otra vez le voy a compartir mi pantallita por una razón. Hoy vamos a ver ya la grammar. ¿Les parece? Yes, right? I know. Hey. Claudita is not here. Menos mal, porque casi le da un ataque. Ok, con el grammar. Ok, very good. So, let's work on that. Who's calling me, by the way? I don't know. Ok, my boss. I'm, I'm, I'm doing good. Don't worry about it. Ok, cool. So, Let's practice, guys. Okay, can you see my screen, guys? Yes. Yes. Okay, okay guys. Vamos a ver entonces grammar focus. And how do we use so, so, to, neither, and either? Quiero que presten atención a esta partecita en particular. Let me check this one. This one, yeah, that's what I want. Yeah, this one. This is the one that I want. Okay, miren la expresión. I like Japanese food a lot. ¿Qué verbo estamos usando en esta sentence? Which verb? Like. Like. Guys, this is present, past, or future? Present. 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 Ok, present. Es a like porque estamos usando primera persona singular. ¿Es that correct? Yes, correct. Yes. Yes, correct. ¿Se acuerdan el auxiliary que se usa para presente? Do. Do. Muy bien. Entonces, si usted dice, I like Japanese food a lot. A mí me gusta mucho la comida japonesa. Y usted le dice, a mí también. Usted puede decir, so do I, ¿se fija? O I do too. ¿Sí? ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Que si usted utiliza el so, está viendo aquí en la pantallita. Quiero que vean todo del lado izquierdo. Si usted usa el so, el so va a ir primero, ¿sí? Luego va a ir el verbo y luego va a ir el sujeto, ¿sí? Pero sí. si usted utiliza el to, va a ir at the end of the sentence. Va a ir el sujeto, el verbo. We have a coma, guys, and don't forget the coma, please, because it's really important. Mm. And then, yes, I know. I yes. teach your punctuation. And, and, y el to va a ir al final, ¿sí? Guys, esto dos es para agreement, ¿sí? Para que usted está eh, de acuerdo en algo, ¿sí? Sure. Prácticamente significa lo mismo, que usted sure. está de acuerdo. Go ahead, listen to you. Uh, is, is necessary point at the end? Yes, it is. Uh, is grammatic? Grammatically correct. Oh, okay. The period, I have it here, you see? Yes. Which are the, the meaning of them is the same. Sí, es lo mismo. Por ejemplo, I like Japanese food a lot. Eh, a mí me gusta mucho la comida japonesa. A mí también. O tú puedes decir, la, la primera es podría de, de transferirse como igualmente yo, so do I. Y I do too, yo también. ¿Es lo mismo, sí o no? Sí. Sí. La, di, la diferencia es... El agreement work usted está usando. If you use so, you gotta put it at the beginning of the sentence. Y si usted se fija, the answer is a short answer, guys. No es long answer. It's short answer. So do I. Yes. Y, and, if, and if you're using to, it has to be, guys, at the end of the answer. Okay? After the verb, 
And after that, coma, okay? Don't forget the coma, please. Mm -hmm. If you, if you quiere preguntar más, you say, really, de verdad? I don't like it very much. A mí no me gusta mucho. Which is the more usually? Um, so, do so, do I. I. so do I. So yes. do I. Sí. Okay. Es la que más se usa. So do I. Okay, guys. Pero vea algo muy importante. Okay. Aquí uh, eh, respondimos con el do porque estamos usando este verbo. Por eso es que yo quiero que pay attention to the verb. Okay. Like mm -hmm. es un present tense. Sí. Y usa yeah. el auxiliary es do. Pero, guys, mm -hmm. si usted, por ejemplo, take a look at the second sentence. Guys, in this particular sentence, uh, Luis, can you please read it for me? Okay. I am crazy about it Italian food. Otra vez, por favor. I'm crazy about Italian food. Very good. ¿Por qué te hice re este, repetirlo otra vez? Tengo la costumbre de decir I am. Exactly. Yes. Muy bien. Si tú ves apostrophe M, es una abbreviation. Tienes yes. que pronunciarla como abbreviation. But very okay. good. Lo hiciste muy bien. Ok, I'm crazy about Italian food. Ok, Luis, te pregunto, ¿cuál es el verbo auxiliar aquí? No, bueno, o el verbo principal. Uh, um, ok, I'm um, very good, very good. ¿Qué clase de verbo es este, guys? To be. To be. be. Present, past, or future. Present. 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 Ok. Present. ¿Por, qué, ¿Por qué les hago esto? Porque si usted va, va a responder con el verbo que esté utilizando en el enunciado. Por ejemplo, I'm crazy about Italian food. Yo estoy uh -huh. loca por la comida italiana. Entonces, cuando usted utilice so o tú, usted va a utilizar el mismo verbo. Mire, la, mire aquí. So am I. I am too. ¿Se fija? Yes. Ok. Por eso es bien importante. Si el verbo que utiliza es do, you have to answer so do I o I do too. Si el verbo que utiliza es am, is o lo que sea, entonces, si es A o cualquier verbo to be, entonces usted lo va, va, va a responder con el verbo to be. So am I, oh, okay. I am too. ¿Ok? okay. Ve, vean el tercer, el tercer ejemplo. I can eat really spicy food. El verbo principal es eat, pero ¿cuál es el auxiliar aquí? Can. Can, exactly. ¿Que, ¿Recuerdan que es un mother verb? ¿Sí? Que significa poder, ability, ¿se recuerdan? Yes. Yeah. yes. Ok. Entonces, si usted tiene un modo for a que es can it, it, it es el principal, okay. pero can es el auxiliar, usted va a responder con el verbo abs, eh, modal ver, modal ver. En este caso, can. I can eat really spicy food. Yo puedo comer comida muy picante. Eh, so can I, o I can too. ¿Sí? ¿Se fija? Yeah. El verbo yes, yes, que yes. ocupamos es el mismo que vamos a ocupar para el short answer, ¿sí? Sure. Y, Yes, I'm listening to you, Luis. Uh, 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 yes, go ahead. Can, um, the, the rules can be uh, uh, the first verb. Ah, no, ya te lo voy a dar. Ya voy a dar las reglas. Don't worry. ¿Estamos sure. bien? Yes, go ahead. Listen uh, to you. I have a question for the first sentence. Mauricio. Yes. Yes, yeah, go ahead and listen to you. Uh, can, I, can I answer the question? Uh, I like Japanese food a lot. Mm -hmm. I can I can answer the question. I like it too. Mm. No. 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 You have to use the verb uh, do. It's incorrect. It's incorrect. Okay. You can say me too. Me too. Mm -hmm. me, too. me too. Yes. Me too. Yes. But I like it too. No. Me too. Teacher. Yes, Gabby. Me too. Um, es como en el español. Mm -hmm. Verbos, I ah, like, Sandrita, yes, yes. Gustar, uh -huh. estar, poder. Exactly. El verbo va adelante. Uh -huh. Exactly. Entonces, I can. Very, yes. Bueno, en la segunda, the second sentence. The one that I'm crazy about Italian food? Yeah? Yeah. Tell me. Eh, voy a ponerlo. They are crazy about Italian food. I say... Yo puedo decir, so are a. Mm -mm. No, si usted solo se me fija, sirve para el I. Sí, solo le sirve para el I porque está okay. usted expresando algo de agreement cuando alguien está hablando con usted. No What puedes, is agreement? Agreement es como que está de acuerdo o desacuerdo con algo. ¿Sí? 
Pero puedo decir, ellos están en desacuerdo con, con cierta cosa. No, si usted quiere Before decir, de, 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 exactly. es, este uso del so, to, neither, either, solo es para first person singular. Uh -huh. okay. si, si ustedes se fijan, todos los ejemplos son con I. No hay ni uno uh -huh. con yes. they ni con she, no. Porque si no, yes. usted, usted, sería, usted diría, si ellos no están de acuerdo, they are not agree with. Uh -huh. Y si están de acuerdo, they are agree with. Usted no va a utilizar ninguna de estas cuatro palabras. Ok. ¿Ya? Yeah. Ajá, ya sabía yo, Moran. <laughs> I, I was expecting your question. Yo, when is going to ask me something? Ok. Very good. Uh, hasta ahorita, con el uso del so y el to, are we ok? Ok. Yes. Yes, ok. Yes. Ok, let's move forward, guys, to the right side, which is basically the use of neither and either. ¿Sí? Yes. Prácticamente... Eh, esto es para decir que usted tampoco. Eh, si usted se fija, esto fue positivo y esto va a ser negativo, right? Ok, pero vea esto. Mira aquí, mira aquí el ejemplo. I don't like salty food. No me gusta la comida salada, right? I don't like. Ok, ¿cuál es el verbo principal aquí, guys? Which is a, a principal verb here? Do, do, no. Do, el, do. no, el principal. El principal es like. 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 Y el auxiliary, guys? Don't. 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 Exactly. Que es en negative way, ¿verdad? Okay. Yes. 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 Very good. Entonces, si usted dice, a mí tampoco me gusta, igual en el mismo caso que el so y el to. Si usted utiliza neither, lo va a utilizar al principio. Después, mire, la respuesta va a ser con el auxiliar, que en este caso es do, y el sujeto. Y si usted utiliza either, va a ser igual que el to. El sujeto, la negación, porque el verbo eh, do en negative way, y el either, al final. Ojo, guys, aquí hay una diferencia. Si usted se fija, con to, utilizó coma, ¿es cierto? Con el yes, either, usted no utiliza coma. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Y algo muy particular, guys. Ambas son negativas porque quiere decir que a usted tampoco le gustan las cosas. Pero si usted utiliza either, el auxiliar me lo va a utilizar en afirmativo. Aunque el enunciado sea negativo. ¿Por qué? Porque neither ya es un agreement una de negación. negación. Exacto, ya una negación. Si usted sería neither don't I, usted estaría como negando sobre negando. Estaría redundando, right yeah. Ok. Yes, yes, yes. Exactly. Entonces, pero si usted va a utilizar either, usted va a utilizar el auxiliar en negativo, así como está en el enunciado. ¿Sí? Esa es la main difference between cualquiera de los dos. ¿Sí? No solo la position en el sentence, sino que con either usted utiliza auxiliary in a, in a positive way y con either utiliza auxiliary in negative way. ¿Sí? ¿Estamos bien ahí? Ok. Yes. yes? Yes. Take, take a look at the second one, guys. Teacher, okay. what do you mean in Spanish? Either? Either y neither. Ni uno ni el otro. Yo tampoco. Mm -hmm. O a mí tampoco. Okay. Both. ¿Sí? Eh... Both. Both, yes. Al menos en este contexto. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What about this, guys? Take a look at the second uh, sentence. Uh, Moran, can you please read for me the second sentence? This one? Yeah. I'm not in the mood for Indian food. Very good. Usted no está de humor para comer comida india. Okay. ¿Qué, ¿Cuál es el auxiliar que estoy usando aquí? Bueno, el, el, verbo, el verbo, en este caso, que estoy utilizando aquí, guys. Um, to be? Um, to, to be. be. Yes, but I'm not yes, is a be. negative way, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Entonces, vea yeah. que usted se fija, usted va a utilizar el mismo verbo, ¿se fija? Yes. La diferencia yes. es que si estoy utilizando neither, voy a utilizar el verbo um, in positive. positive way. Exactly. And if I'm using either, I'm going to use it in negative a way. negative way. Negative, exactly. negative way. Mm -hmm. Y vean la tercer ejemplo. Can you please read it for me? Um, Gerardo, the last sentence, please. Can you read it for me, Gerardo? ¿Me escucha, Gerardo? Creo que no escucha, Gerardo, ¿verdad? 
no. Pero no. Mm, quiero ver entonces quién me ayuda con esto. Fernando. Ok. I can stand fast food. Very good. You can stand fast food. No tolero la comida rápida. Ok. El verbo principal, guys, is this one. Stand, right? Stand. Stand. Pero ¿cuál es el modo ver auxiliar en negativo? Can't. 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 Exacto. Can't. Este mismo lo voy a usar como respuesta. Can't. Can't. Exactly. Pero neither como, can, como I, estoy usando neither, can, el can es en... Positive. En positive. Yeah. Y como usando en either, el can't es en negative. negative. All right. Entonces usted yeah. puede decir, de plano, yo sí. O, de, oh, I love it. A mí me gusta. Sí. <laughs> Aunque la persona no le guste, pero a, a ti sí. Mm -hmm. Tiene que concordar siempre. Mm -hmm. Ok. Are we good on that, guys? Sí. Es fácil, ¿verdad? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Is it? Is it? Don't worry. Yes. Sí lo voy a mandar, ¿ok? Well, gotta be patient with me. Ok. Very the good. This is a um, little difficult. Yes. Aquí tengo yo algo para que ustedes más o menos tengan una idea. So, let me share right now with you. So you could have an idea. Es como un resumen de lo que hemos visto so far. Que se lo he tratado de explicar. Díganme si pueden verlo. Can you see it, guys? Yes. Sí. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. So yes. the premium words. So too, neither in either. Miren, examples. I'm hungry. I'm too. So am I. Sí. I love apple pie. Yes. I do too. So do I. I can't play chess. Puedo jugar ajedrez. I can too. So can I. Ven que se responde con el mismo verbo. The difference yes. is a position yes. of too and to. Yes. Very good. Yes. Ok, miren, take a look, guys. Miren, aquí está, ¿ve? ¿eh? Aquí es lo que, lo que Luis quería saber. Positioning of two. Miren, we have subject, subject. auxiliary, and two. Auxiliary. And two. Plus two. Exactly. And then we have so. Es, es diferente. We have so, auxiliary, and subject. ¿Sí? Subject. So do I. ¿Sí? ¿Se acuerdan? So can I. Two. ¿Sí? Estamos so bien hasta I. aquí. <laughs> exactly. So am I, exactly. ¿Estamos bien hasta ahí, Luis? Uh, my commentary uh, ¿Sí? was, was the sentences, uh, the, 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 the verbs. Mm -hmm. um, it was two verbs. Ajá, uh which -huh. ones? Ajá, ok. Uh, the first verbs, uh, the rule, the first verbs is that I, I answer with the first, the first verbs. Mm -hmm. Exactly. You answer with the first verb. But for example, Luis, like the example of when we're using like um, like a model verb and the main verb, like I can stand fast food, for example. Okay? Okay. A stand is the main verb, isn't it? Uh, the, the, two, uh, the second verb. Aha, uh -huh, exactly. However, we have can, that is the model verb, okay? That will okay. Have, so if, when you have that, you're going to answer with the model verb, okay? Okay. No with the member. Mm -hmm. Is it clear okay. now? Oh, see, it's, it's clear. Okay, cool. Let's yes. continue. Okay, guys. So this is what we're talking about. Uh, neither and either. The use of them. If you can see, guys, we have neither yes. with a negative auxiliary, right? And with positive auxiliary, we use either. Take a look at the example. I'm not hungry. I'm not either. Neither am I. You see? I don't dance salsa. I don't either, neither do I. I can't swim. I can't either, neither can I. Is it clear now with examples? Yes. yes, yes, yes. Okay, and then guys, we have the formula. Subject, negative auxiliary, either. Neither, positive auxiliary, subject. Okay. Okay, no. sounds yes. good, right? Okay. okay. Yeah. You're welcome. So is it clear now? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes, yes. Oh it's my good. god. It's clear. Okay, so guys, this is going to be your homework. Ah. Oh, wow. Yes. Why? Oui. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're so happy, right, Gabby? Yeah. Isn't it amazing? We're starting the homework. first day of the weekend. I have it's a homework. Great. great. <laughs> That's why I love this teacher. Now I'm going to quit. No, I'm just kidding. Okay, guys. So 
I'm going to send you the file, okay, because this is really easy. Once you follow the rules, everything's going to work fine. And I just want you guys to give me one example of each of them, okay? One example with so, one example with, um, with two, one example with neither, one example with either, but one example with auxiliary do, with auxiliary with the verb to be, and with the model verb can. Okay? okay? One of each one. Okay? I just, and you're going to write it. Okay? So you're going to read it for me tomorrow. It only neither, either? All of them. So two, either, That's neither. Mm -hmm. Okay. All of them. Everything that we have oh, seen so far. Yes. So I just want you to double check if you understood or not. Okay. Yes. Are we going to write uh, questions? And just, answers. Just the sentences, like the one that we have seen. Sentences. Like the sentences. Like, like your examples. Are, like the examples. Yes. Don't complicate okay. your life. Use examples. Uh, easy examples. Okay. Don't complicate. Okay. Yes. Give, 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 up, give us the sample. For WhatsApp. No, the example, <laughs> the example will be Please, the, power, the PowerPoint file. That's going to be the example. <laughs> ah. Share with oh. us examples. <laughs> Please. Send us, send us the sample. Yes, I'm going to send you the PowerPoint file. And there you okay. have the sample, okay? That's, that's, mm -hmm. that's okay. Yes. And okay. then you will be able to give it to me. And tomorrow, guys, we're going to practice another tongue called Twister. Okay? Okay. Okay, teacher. Yes. Okay, guys, any questions so far? Any doubts that you might have right now? No. Everything no. is clear? No. Yes. Like water or like chata? Or chata. <laughs> or chata. <laughs> or chata. <laughs> Who said that? Edgardo, come <laughs> on. All righty. Oh, my God, you are so mean. Huh. That's Okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to take into consideration to continue being your teacher. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Don't worry <laughs> about that. No, no, no. I'm so happy. I'm so happy to, to see you guys once again. Please study. Try to get into the platform so you can do the exercises. All right? Everything. Okay. Because if you do not do the exercises, you won't pass to the next model. And it's really important that you do. And if you have any doubts of the exercises or something is not working, or maybe I have my, uh, one of the students that tried to do the exercises from the previous class, but I don't know what happens that I think he uses the wrong password and that was not working. So if something happens to you like that, I just want you to t let me know so I can report it and they can help you. Okay. Okay. Okay, you guys. Too. Have a nice night. Take care and see you tomorrow. Okay. You too. See you tomorrow. Bye.